Nikita, you just won a very nice game against Georg Maia. First of all, congratulations. Uh, you opened the game with 1e4 and he played your pet, one of your pet lines, the French defense. So how did the game go? Uh, thank you. Uh, I don't think uh, French uh, is my pet line. Yeah, it's just an opening I played uh, some years ago and, and just uh, I wrote a book and uh, everybody mentioned it. I don't know why. So it, it was just uh, a book. I, I don't pretend it's, it's, um, it's a good one. Uh, I mean, it's up to readers. So, uh, yeah, actually, uh, speaking of the game, yeah. Uh, it was more or less balanced, but then he uh, he played knight c4 check, yeah, which I actually blundered, but it was a lucky blunder, yeah. And uh, after that, I got initiative, yeah, and uh, and won. Uh, which do you, so you think that was the turning point after knight c4? At which moment did you feel you were winning this game? Um, actually, when my knight came to d6, yeah. After that, I think it's. Uh, yeah, it's winning for white. So a perfect start for you. Two out of two. Uh, how do you feel so far? Good. Yeah, I think. But uh, it's uh, you know uh, it's uh, seven rounds uh, further. So I'm just uh, trying to play from game to game and uh, okay, nothing special. Uh, during the commentary, Peter Leko said that uh, you actually you excel at beating uh, players around this rating 2650 which is why you also have such a good record uh, in open tournaments and how far do you agree with Peter? Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. Do you feel you have a very good score against, do you have good results against players around that rate? I, I never thought about it, uh, maybe but uh, I don't know actually what to say. If, if Peter said it maybe it's true, yeah. Okay, and to conclude this interview, a few random questions. Uh, first of all, tell us, when did you decide to become a professional chess player and why? Uh, yeah, because it's the only thing I can do. So, uh, uh, I don't know why. Uh, there wasn't a particular moment, so I just, uh, I was playing from tournament to tournament and uh, finally it brought me here, so I don't know. Are you happy with the choice? Uh, yes, but uh, you know, to be happy, yeah, of course I'm happy, but uh, I have nothing to, to compare with, so, you know. Uh, bishop or knight? Uh, knight. And finally, have you ever played the king's gambit as a surprise weapon with the white pieces? Never. Would you? Uh, not really. Okay, thank you very much and best of luck for tomorrow. Thank you.